First, tell us that 19-year-old Devin Brantley and a young woman lost their lives in that crash during a 100-mile-per-hour police pursuit through Nicholas County last night. News Channel 3's Kim Rafferty spoke with Devin's father, who wishes he could see his son again. If Shane Brantley could say one more thing to his son Devin, Shane would tell him not to go. I love you. Stay home. They were babies, man. Just before 3 in the afternoon Thursday, troopers say a motorcycle was clocked traveling roughly 120 miles an hour down Route 19 towards Summersville. He said he was going to go more to get gas and he'd be right back. He's supposed to took me or his brother there to get his old, uh, get his old truck and he never come back. That driver was Shane's 19-year-old son, Devin Brantley, who is also from Birch River, along with a juvenile passenger. His girlfriend, was she was close to us, too. They, they grew up together. They were school sweethearts. A sergeant with state police turned on his lights and sirens for a traffic stop of the motorcycle. Troopers say the motorcycle turned onto Young's Monument Road then turned back onto Route 19, hitting a log truck and ejecting the two from the motorcycle. Both Brantley and his passenger were pronounced dead at the scene of the crash. The last conversation with his son plays over and over in his mind. He always says, love you. And, and this time it was, you know, like, a, I love you, Dad. Kim Rafferty, WSAZ News Channel 3, Nicholas County. Uh, the name of Devin's girlfriend who was involved in that crash has not been released by state police.